Hi everybody. Welcome to Frost Artists for Life Art Studios. And this is uh this is Happy Owl. So I have a big piece of a really nice piece of um glass. It's really, really cool. Um I'm loving it. It's just an acrylic glass piece. Uh, like plexiglass, you know, same thing. And on this side over here, y'all, this peels off when I get ready. This side is the side I'm going to be working on. And I'm going to be doing a lot of mixed media on it. I'm going to be doing several different things on it, okay? So, um, I'm not going to be putting you through the torment and watching all of it along the way because it's probably going to take a few hours or so. So I will be speeding it up and cutting it along the way. But for now, let me get my head wrapped around it and see where I'm going to start. See you in a minute. Ah, uh, heck, I didn't want it down there. I'll do that. Not down there. Oh, come on, I need this to do right. 
Do right, do right. It's not that it's not doing right. I'm probably not doing right. <laughs> it's probably doing just fine. I'm probably, probably the one that's not doing right. But it's turning out the way I want it, actually, believe it or not. It's just uh, hard getting to it. Because I don't know exactly what I'm doing. I have some idea. That's it, right there, that's it, that's what I wanted. Where's my thing, there we go, the tops. The tops, we needed the tops. And this down here, oh wait, is that, yeah, green blue. I need to blend that in right in there. So let me see if I can get that. Uh -uh. Maybe with a little bit of this one. Uh -huh. Which one did I do? The blue green? Yeah. Right on top of this. Oh, I'm about out of it. That's what's happening. <laughs> I'm about out of it. No, don't go yet. Don't go yet. I need you. I need you. Don't go yet. it okay I'm good with that now all right okay I'm back to do some other stuff to this I'm gonna start uh yeah I'm gonna start with some black
at it again. I turn this around so I can get to over here where I want to be. Um, and I'm just putting some color down here in the flowers that I wanted to be coming off of this tree. It's not a dead tree. It just looks like it. <laughs> yeah, so just some more colorful things I wanted to do on here. And then I'm done in blue and white. Yeah, that's going to be real pretty through there. Like I said, down here is still going to be black for the most part. There'll be some green, but most of it's going to be black. And then we pick up the color as the pick up the uh, glitter as the color starts. So this is a half ounce, and it's called Shearwood. My drier days. So yeah, if you uh, like it, it looks great, y'all. Let me let's see if I can. Sh I don't know if y'all can see it down here good, but I just want to show you. It's pretty. It's real. A lot of greenery in it. Mostly all green. Maybe some blues in it. It's very beautiful, beautiful glitter. So yeah, that's what I'm. Uh, I have that, and let me see. I've got another one of hers that I haven't tried yet. Um, oh, yeah, I did, because she sent me a little small sample of it. And that's this one. This is Paris Lights, and it's a gold. It's absolutely fabulous. Oh, my gosh. Makes me want to just put it on everything in the whole wide world. <laughs> it's so awesome. <laughs> Like, really, really. So, yeah, them. And and I've got some wonderful uh, stuff over here I had to pull out, too. Golden Sparkle Glass Glitter that I got from, this is from Lorez. Now, I don't have any of this in here yet. 
but I don't know what's going to get in here before it's all over. What I will do, though, is try to put everything that I put in here to the side and see if I can put it, if I can remember to put all of it down. Um, I don't normally write down what I use. I just, you know, I just don't do it because a lot of times I use so many different things, you guys, and mix stuff up so much, you know. But uh, I'll try to at least put down the links uh, to Laura's store and the dryer days. Um, yeah, so, you know, you can, if you want to get some nice glitter and some different things, that'll be the places to go. Uh, both of them have their own stores and a lot of different things and different, you know, in both of them. So it's, it's pretty cool. So. I can't wait to be able to put color on this. Now, I've got a lot of work I'm going to be doing over here, okay? So this is not going to stay blank. This is going to have some stuff on it later on. Oh, no. I'm trying to get glitter on it already. I don't want no glitter up there. Okay. So we're going to leave this like this here, and we'll get back to it and check it tomorrow. Okay? Peace. Okay, guys, I went in here and put a couple of um, dragonflies. And I went in here and put a couple of butterflies. Part of it's done in acrylic ink pen, and part of it's done in uh, embossing stuff. So over here, I'm sorry I didn't have the phone on then, but over here, um, I have the video on. I'm doing some different paste for a big butterfly here. It's going to be real pretty. And we'll do a couple more through here, I think. Not sure, sure, but I think so. Um, this butterfly is going to be different colors, of course. So, the paste I'm using is uh, Viva Modeling Paste. And I get this from Laura's Art Corner on Facebook. And I will have that description in the bottom of the video.